Hi, I'm Shorty and welcome back to my YouTube channel, Shorty Skate Series. In this video, I'll be going over a stall called Around the World. It's a plate stall where you jump 180 on the coping and then drop in. Before attempting this trick, I recommend that you are confident in stalling and jumping 180 on flat ground in skates. If you can plate stall to 180 exit, that's a bonus skill to have as it already helps you with the rotation. I have all these three tutorials on my YouTube channel and I'll add links below. Step 1. The first step is to stall and transfer your weight onto the deck by pushing your knees over your toes. This allows you to hold the stall for a long time as you'll be balanced on your slide blocks and your front wheels. Step 2. Once you have a stable stall with your weight on the deck, you want to twist your upper body in the direction you want to jump. It should be about 90 degrees and you should be able to spot the coping where your feet will be landing. From this position, you have already started the turn. An optional step if you find jumping the full 180 a little scary is to twist your skates in the direction you want to turn until you can't twist them anymore. This means your lower body has also turned a quarter of the way before you even jump. It also helps you to be a little bit more stable on the coping as you can lock onto the coping with a bit of wheel pressure. Step 3. Load your legs and bend your knees. You want to jump 180 but land one foot on the coping and the other one on the deck parallel to the coping. Being parallel means you can land the foot quite close to the coping and there is less risk of slipping forwards or backwards. Once you have landed the jump, step the deck foot onto the coping and drop in. Note you'll be pushing through your slide block and forefoot of your skates as your heel should be hanging over the coping. Step 4. Now that you are confident in landing one foot on the coping, it's time to jump both at the same time. This part can be a little scary at first, so don't be afraid to ask a friend to lend a hand or do the trick near a handrail. Since you'll be spinning 180, you want your friend to stand on the side you are spinning towards. Give them your hand that is the furthest one away from them. This is because as you jump 180, you will unwind yourself and it will become the closest hand. Final step. Once you are comfortable with doing a 180 jump with support, the last step is to try it solo. If you jump onto the coping with your axis a little forward, you'll roll straight back into the ramp once you land. If you are looking to hold the stall a little longer, then you need to think about putting your weight into your heels as soon as you land the 180 jump. From there, you can experiment with different exits. I hope you're able to take a couple things away from this video that will help you with your around the world stalls. If you have any questions, please comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Also, please tag me on Instagram, shortstop.6, as I'd love to see your progress. Thank you for watching and please like and share this video if you found it helpful. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more skating tips and tricks.